What's up, guys? It is Airborne Sapper giving you a haul video, doing it a little different because I got a lot of books to cover. Now, this is what I picked up from my pull list a couple of back issues, and I also went to a yard sale, met a cool guy, picked up some cool books. So, let me show you what I picked up. Now, first, you see Hillbilly 3, really enjoying the series. The series is really good. Happy was able to pick this up. You know I had to grab the Deadpool 19. Enjoying this series right now. Also picked up Deadpool Annual. I love how this is a cover swipe off of a Spider-Man cover. Deadpool rocking the VHS. I know a lot of you guys have no idea what that is. <laughs> also had to pick up Doctor Strange. I love the last series, so I'm interested to see what they're going to do for this one right here. And you already know, I had to grab the hip-hop variant. Loving this Doctor Strange. Like how they have the symbol in the back of Doctor Strange. If you don't know what that is, Google it. <laughs> but not going to talk too much about this cover, because you know I'm going to do my hip-hop series. Also picked up the previews like to see what's coming out and get a sneak peek of the issues picked up the other preview <laughs> and actually this spider-man series looks like it's going to be pretty good especially the jessica jones and the champion looks like it's going to be pretty good so i can't wait to pick that up picked up my back issue of scarlet witch i actually thought i had this one but i cannot find it anywhere so had to pick that up this one will probably be in my next video. Definitely with the Spidey. You know, I can't tell you enough about this cover. So you guys would just have to check out my hip-hop cover swipe whenever that airs. Picked up the Drax. Nice cover by Mike Cho. One of my favorite artists right now. Definitely happy to grab that along with the hip-hop series. Moon Girl in Devil Dinosaur number one. I, f I have the hip-hop version, but don't have the regular cover, so I actually might start reading this series and see what it's about. Had to fill a couple of my Deadpool hauls, the Deadpool holes, from series four, so I picked up number five. Also picked up this interesting little piece. Uh, this is Deadpool 3.1. I think a lot of this is in Spanish. I'm not sure. But looking at the cover, I can tell you that I have no idea what it says. <laughs> Was searching in the dollar bin, and I found this run of War Machine. Uh, I like the way the cover looks, so I decided I'm going to check this out to see what this is about. This is number four. This is number six. Or, I'm sorry, number five. This is number six. Number seven. Number eight. And number nine. Now, as I was saying, I went to a yard sale. And I picked up a couple of great books. Uh, a lot of old books that I really had to research to figure out <laughs> what they are. So let me show you what I picked these up, what I picked up. And these actually were 50% to 75% off. The guy was pretty cool. He was a vet. And we talked about military time and, you know, how it was for him and how it was for me. Way different for him <laughs> uh, than me. Uh, he's a, um, a Vietnam, so... He had it much rougher, you know, overseas and coming back. So I'm, I'm really happy that I ended up meeting him. Gave him my number. Told uh, him if he had any books to just hit me up. So very happy I did that. This is Batman 363. Uh, I believe there's a first appearance uh, introduction uh, of uh, this character right here. So, I mean, you guys know I'm all about the Marvel, so... Really don't know anything else about this. But I actually like the purple background of the cover. This right here 
is Batman 366, which is the first Jason Todd in a Batman uniform, or I'm sorry, Robin uniform. I actually like the uh, cover of it, uh, Joker with both pistols, so, you know, happy I picked that up. This is a Frank Miller Batman 404. The Year of the Bat Part 1. I think I have another Year of the Bat, but I'm not sure uh, what, which uh, volume is it. It might be 2 or 3. This is What If the Avengers have nev Has Never Been. So this is a pretty good book. I actually read it and I actually enjoyed it. Did not pay that. So don't worry about it. Uh, but this is a great book. So happy I picked this up. Really into this what if. Kind of gives you a different aspect of what happened. Uh, what if the Phoenix had, had, had not died? So, you know, very happy I picked up this book. Uh, I've seen it a lot around. Never had it for my what if collection. So, happy I picked this up. This is what if number 32. Awesome Avenger cover. This is Strange Tales 40 or 143. I, I believe this is the first, uh, not the first appearance, but the uh, origin of the Ancient One. Uh, it's not in the best condition. It's in a decent condition for its age. So, another good pickup, I guess. Gotta change these mylars on these. Uh, this is Marvel Spotlight. Number eight, the Ghost Rider. So this is an early appearance of the Ghost Rider. And you know, things with him uh, is blowing up, especially for the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. show. And apparently he might be on a Netflix series. Another Marvel Spotlight, Ghost Rider, number 11. This is Doctor Strange, 173. Uh, I... This has a appearance of uh, DeMarmo, but I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's not the first appearance, but I think that's the only key thing in this issue. If I'm wrong, you might you can blast me on the comments. So, another good pickup, I think. Uh, this is Uncanny X-Men number 151. The day Kitty Pirate leaves the X-Men. This is another great cover, uh, Wolverine versus Sabretooth in Uncanny X-Men 212. This is King Size Annual X-Men number 5. X-Men Fantastic Four. Finding, fighting Green Men. <laughs> Uh, this is another annual, uh, all-new X-Men, annual number 10. And this is Uncanny X-Men and the new Teen Titans. I wonder, you know, actually, I wonder if they're going to start doing crossovers again. Because I remember Marvel, Marvel and DC did that for a while. This is Ninja Turtles number one. Definitely a reprint re of Ninja Turtles. Uh, I really, I just seen it and I was like, you know, what the heck? Uh, I picked this one up. So this is definitely a reprint. Uh, this is issue number two. Now I have no idea about Ninja Turtles. Uh, I'm not sure if this is a reprint or not. It doesn't say, but I mean, this is number two issue, so I'll probably read that later on. This is. Ninja Turtles, Teeny Mutant Ninja Turtles, number nine. This is New Mutants 100. Of course, everyone knows this book. This is the first uh, appearance of the X Force. And right here, we have Incredible Hulk 2, or sorry, 160, or 126. Uh, I believe there's a parent of a character in there. I'm not too sure. Uh, probably should have researched these books more, but just had to show you guys what I picked up. So, very cool early Hulk book. 
You think that's it? But no, that's not. Damn. Okay. Here we go. This is Captain America, number 241. A beautiful Frank Miller cover. This Punisher just blasting Captain America. Uh, this is Spectacular, or Peter Parker, Spectacular Spider-Man, number 109. This is King Size Annual, Peter Parker, Spectacular Spider-Man, Annual 1. This is Marvel Team-Up, Spider-Man and Nighthawk, number 33. This is Marvel Team Up 58 or 58 Spider Man with Ghost Rider. This is the, the Defenders number 11. This is Guardians of the Galaxy number 1. Amazing Spider-Man 254. This is Daredevil, Man Without Fear, number 182. Beautiful Frank Miller cover. Look at that's Frank Miller. Another Daredevil, Man Without Fear, 183. Iconic. Punisher just blasting Deadpool in the chest. Detective Comics number 649. And I already know I didn't put these in order. <laughs> this is Detective Comics number 611. Detective Comics 626. I actually picked these up because I actually like these covers. So, I mean, if anything for DC, I'm definitely going to get into Batman. This is Detective Comics 629. I mean, I love, like, pink covers. I really actually like because it brings... Look how awesome Batman is standing out of this cover. I mean, it's just amazing. And last but not least, we have Detective Comics 638. Alright guys, this is Airborne Sapper. Happy you guys watched through this long video. Let me know if I should switch it back to the way I did hauls. Or this way, I figured you guys would get a better look at the cover without the glare. So, this is Airborne Sapper. Peace out, you guys have a good one. Bye.